Hello everybody and welcome back to another great video where I get to show you my Queen Helgar army and today we are going to take a look at the Dwarf Thunderers. My name of course is Trevor Ursulescu, owner of Monster Hobbies in High River, Alberta, Canada and if you want to see what Warhammer models we have available right now online check us out at www.monster-hobbies.ca and now without further ado let's go check on Queen Helgar's Thunderers. Although some more traditional dwarves still regard the handgun with suspicion, it has become as common a sight in dwarf armies as a crossbow. The dwarves who specialize in the handgun have become known as thunderers. Today we're going to be looking at the last of our infantry units from Queen Helgar's army, and these are the dwarf thunderers. Now I got these model kits again from my friend James in sort of a half-built condition, so I ended up finishing off the job. Here we have our command crew for Queen Helgar's Thunderers, and in this case I've used the little dog from the Bretonian set, and each of these warriors are armed with a buckler with the letter F on it, because I ran out of the H's. Now uh, here I have that tree motif on our banner, again using wooden glyphs and wooden runes, because these guys are all in the forests of Gyran, where wood is more plentiful than metal. However, because of the warp gates, I figure they are able to go off into other realms and get some metal, maybe from uh, Shaman or something like that. And here you can see we've got the champion of the unit. He's the only guy with horns. Then, of course, our banner, standard bearer, and our musician, who in this case is playing drums. Looking at the models from side view, you can see all the nice detail work in here. I did use a little drill to drill out the gun butt. There you've got uh, the little buckler with the letter F on it again. The standard bearer is holding his forward. And then here we've got our drummer and on his back is another set of handguns. From the back view you can see all the nice little ammo pouches on here. As well as again wooden runes. There we've got your better view of your pistol here for the drummer. Then the pistol on the back of the standard bearer as well. And of course our champion is firing his rifle. But again, you can see the nice chainmail work on here, which again is painted green to match the forest color. And uh, the gun pouches as well for the gunpowder. From this side view, you can get a better look at the hunting dog, as well as the little glyphs hanging off the bottom of the drumsticks. And uh, more detail on the champion, of course. He's got a little bit of metal on his bracelet, but mostly it is again green cloth. Here we have basically three of the Dwarf Thunderers. I've made the rest of the models here much the same. These of course are just the standard warriors. And as you can see they are all holding rifles. These rifles are wheel lock, which is sort of an early uh, version of guns, maybe around the uh, early uh, 1600s or 1700s in our timeline of course. Now they all have uh, different colored beards, but I didn't do anybody with blonde except for the champion. Oh, actually, and the musician. But here you can see a red, brown, and black beard. Again, they all have these little glyphs stuck into their beards, and they're wearing chainmail. Each Dwarf Thunderer has the Queen Helga buckler with an F on it, as well as the gunpowder pouches and some glyphs. Now, sadly, the Dwarf Thunderers are no longer used in Warhammer Age of Sigmar, they did get phased out during the Cities of Sigmar of 2nd edition, however you can still feel them as compendium models, but now with Warhammer Age of Sigmar 3rd edition they have finally been phased out. Which is quite sad considering that they were originally brought out for Warhammer Fantasy and lasted for a very long time in the Dwarf Army, but that's how it goes. So if you've built these model kits in the past, we would love to see your pictures and your take on them over on our Facebook page, and I'll leave the link for that in the description below. Well, I hope you enjoyed that look at Queen Helgar's Thunderers, and remember, if you want to check out our latest models that are available right now at Monster Hobbies, don't forget to check us out at www.monster-hobbies.ca. And if you like these amazing videos, remember to like, subscribe, and share this channel with all your friends and family. And until next time, everybody, happy wargaming.